So a lot of y'all have been asking me for my settings. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys my entire settings, everything. I'm on windowed full screen, so I can tab out. I'm on 1440p monitor, 360 FPS. Performance mode depreciated. This one's the best. Legacy performance mode. Brightness, mats. Uh, maximum 3D resolution. I don't know what this is. Everything else on low. Reflex performance on plus boost. And these are all my audio settings. These are my game settings. And I am on edit on release. I used to turn edit on release on and off a lot, but I just think edit on release is best. Makes you a lot faster. And these are all the other settings. Uh, make sure you have these two off, by the way. If you have these two things on like this, when you tab out your FPS versus 30, you see? So just turn this off. These are the game UI settings. Uh, you can just pause if you want to see them. All right, mouse settings. My 6.4 sensitivity, 800 DPI. Coloring sense, 31, 32. This is the same. Zooming. I don't know what, even what this stuff is. All right, I do have double movement, 70, 90, 135. And yeah, that's it. All right, binds. This is very important. C is crouch, shift is sprint. And yeah, you can just pause them all if you want to see this. I don't have my pickaxe binded to here. Never bind your pickaxe on combat, by the way. Pro tip. Uh, use, I have scroll pickup, so my uses, uh, scroll up. Crouch. My wall is one of my mouse buttons, my top mouse button. Uh, yeah, just pause this. Make sure if you're using scroll wheel reset, make sure you have it on here. Don't use the old scroll wheel reset. This is way better. Just put your scroll wheel reset on this. Make it like your reset down, whatever you have. Scroll, just scroll it down. Uh, yeah, these are my, all my other binds. Miscellaneous. Put your pickaxe right here. Toggle pickaxe. Now, pickaxe is my other mouse button, like this one. With toggle pickaxe, and just spam this. It'll just pull out my shotgun and pickaxe and just keep spamming it. That's why it's better. And it's just faster. Make sure you have it right here. And cursor mode. Make sure your inventory bind is right here on cursor mode. So my inventory is my tab button. I basically hold it down to pull out my inventory. And then if I want to get rid of my inventory, I just let go and it goes away. That's all it is. And yeah, you can just pause and see all these other set binds. I don't think these even matter to be honest, but uh, if you want to see all this, you can. All right, now for controller. I play controller occasionally. I'm still pretty decent at it. Now this is my controller sense. You can just pause this if you want to see it. Uh, build mode two, two, horizontal 43, 43. Uh, this, this. Look dampening time zero, linear, 100% aim assist, obviously. Stick zone 5-5 five, five on everything. And the controller I use is a dual sense edge with two paddles. My left paddle is to jump and my right paddle is crouch. And these are all the other binds. I used to be so good on controller back in the day, man. Yeah, those are all my binds. Fun fact, I still have more hours on controller than keyboard. Also, another fun fact, when I started playing keyboard four years ago, I just straight copied Klitz's binds. And guess what? Every single kid back then just called me a Klitz fanboy. And because of that, I literally switched all my binds. Which I'm really glad I switched, by the way. Because with Klitz's binds, I was like really bad. I missed. So figure out your own binds and settings is way better than just copying someone else. Oh! <laughs> oh! I killed the team. Good job. Nice, you win! Good match, good match. 200 right now. Come back, come back. No! <laughs> come back, come back. Nice! Let's, let's go, fam! 